I want to share with you how this works for cold calling because cold calling, when you really think about it, cold calling, it's basically you as a salesman knocking on the door of a potential prospect, right? So you're actually intruding in on their time, but why most cold calls are ineffective is because the cold call starts with questions. Like, hey, like you're Gus. Like, hey, are you in the market to refinance? Hey, it's Gus, it's a great day at my company. Just giving you a call to see if you put any thought to those numbers. That's a question. Whereas Geraldo is gonna be a little bit more statement oriented. So he's gonna use the script at salesroommaster.com because I told you, you already got the script. It's Geraldo, he's plugged in. So he already knows what to say. So when he's calling on his cold call leads, he has statements, he doesn't have questions. He has statements because statements puts the prospect under the idea that it's already happening. <laughs> the wheels are moving, bro. Like whether you like it or not, Jim, it's already on its way. Does that make sense? So there's a huge difference. Trigger leads, whether it's trigger leads from internal or portfolio loans at your company services or they're not. Like let's say you're, you're actually giving calls to people who pulled their credit through Experian, right? And your company buys uh, TransUnion data. Well, Geraldo knows that most of the time, if you were to call these people, their main concern is like, how did you get my information? How do you know that I'm in the market? Why are you monitoring my credit? Geraldo understands that because he's already went through the resistance enough. Unlike Gus, Gus is just enthusiastic. He's just like red bulled up. So he's going to continue doing the same exact process over and over and over again. He's a systematic robot. Whereas, whereas Geraldo is a little bit more methodical. He's very aware. So instead of calling a trigger lead and saying, hey, we just got information that you're applying for a mortgage, putting the prospect on guard, Geraldo is a little bit more methodical. And Geraldo is going to initiate the conversation as if it's already happening. But how it also works with internet leads, warm transfers, realtors, um, it even works with like past clients or departed agents, past clients, even the title leads that you get and the follow-ups, even leads that you accumulate through social media. The reason why it works with any and all of these is because it's through emotional intelligence that you're simply orchestrating the engagement to powerfully impact the thought pattern of, your, of the person you're engaging with, the prospect you're engaging with. You are literally driving their attention and you're doing it through the proper wordplay and the proper way of actually engaging with that person so you can quickly assess and find out why they need to give you more attention. And then you leverage that reason why to have them follow you to the pitch table and then you methodically pitch your service in a way where it doesn't sound like a sale, it more or less sounds like a collaboration. You pitch your sale in a way where it doesn't sound like an offer. It sounds like a prescription, like this is what you need, right? Does that make sense? And he doesn't ask to move forward. He assumes it and paints the map of how to actually begin the process.